It was a quiet day in the Yolo Mofo desert. Nothing was happening and there was no sign of civilization for miles. Lurking amongst the lifeless mountains, making small talk to pass the time, were the zebra, the leopard, the tiger and the giraffe. Some time ago, they were all sneezed on by a unicorn, a life-changing event that turned them rainbow-coloured permanently. They had forgiven the unicorn over time though, and had grown to like their new outfits. I can't believe how narrow-minded I was, said the zebra. I think I look fabulous in these colours, and it really brings out my sexy diagonal stripes. I know, said the leopard. I made such a fuss at the time, but now I would never go back to my conforming ways. Screw being camouflaged, I love my rainbow fur and I'm proud to be different from all the other leopards. Yeah, I look awesome, said the tiger. I thought being orange was the way forward in life, but I think I look much more fierce with my colourful outfit. Everyone loves a rainbow cat, right? Too right, the leopard roared in agreement. The unicorn did us all a favour, said the giraffe. I love how I stand out amongst the other giraffes. They're always trying to be different, especially the albino ones. Always got some story about their pigments and whatnot, and I'm like, whatever man, I'm a rainbow giraffe. You lose. And as if by magic, who should appear but the naughty rude unicorn? He was looking for somewhere to party, and he could see the rainbow animals from miles away amongst the lifeless desert sands. Hey guys, he beamed in excitement. You all look great. Mind if I join you? Not at all, said the zebra. It's good to see you, but there's not much to do here though, so you might get bored, said the leopard. Our economy crashed, so now nothing ever grows here, said the tiger. And there's nowhere for us to party, said the giraffe. Oh, really? The unicorn replied. Well, that's disappointing. I got myself all excited. Well, I guess we could just sit here and play charades or something then. The unicorn took this awkward silence to pop to the bathroom. I hope they don't mind, said the unicorn. I just couldn't hold it in any longer. Ah, oh, that feels much better. The unicorn had left a big shiny rainbow poo that stank of something epic and out of this world. Oh, come on, not again. That's nasty, cried the zebra. That smells making me dizzy from all the way up here, said the giraffe. I kind of like it, purred the tiger. Something weird is happening, unicorn, said the leopard. What have you been eating? Look, the unicorn squealed in excitement. My magical turb must have fertilised the land and created new life. The animals gazed in amazement as the Yolomofo desert grew into a sparkly mystical forest full of wonder and excitement. creature amongst the rainbow branches and pink toadstools? asked the zebra. Why that's the walricorn of course, said the unicorn. Part walrus, part unicorn. A majestic creature from the dark side. The walricorn is powerful, brave, courageous and brings peace and harmony. They also love to party hard and this guy knows where it's at. Who's in?